Hello, I'm, I'm Julia and I'm from Arizona State University and I'm here at COP23 in Bonn, Germany with my friend Emmanuel Yengi. Where are you from? I'm from Uganda, Kampala, and what? I'm a student at Macke University studying environmental sciences. What are you doing here? I'm here for COP23 and to and to come and represent i've come to represent care about climate i'm part of the delegation so we have come to communicate more about climate change and also see how we can build our capacity as the young people so when i go back home i also go and teach the youth in my community and in my university about what i learned from here and about climate change great yeah thank you so yeah he like many students here um, are part of non-governmental organizations and results of other different types of committees here um, that are representing different areas of the world. So there's people from all over the world here. Um, it's pretty crazy if we'd done this call in person, I would have given you a tour, but I might send you a different video of that. Um, so um, as introduction to COPS, and if, if you did the worksheets for class, you kind of have an idea. Um, but if not, it's this giant conference, and so this is COP23, which means it's the 23rd, 23 years, conference of parties and they're hosted all over the world so last year it was in Marrakesh in Morocco and the year before it was in Paris and that's where the Paris Agreement um, was created if you've heard about that in the news at all so the US is currently not in the Paris Agreement we pulled out but today or we very recently actually Syria which is one of the countries that wasn't in it decided to opt in which is really huge um, so today so far has been I think pretty slow I haven't gone over to the negotiation area um, but uh, this morning, whenever we had an update from yesterday, there's ceremonies happened yesterday, and then there were some issues with um, the Iranian government not agreeing with the agenda, which is kind of the order of what we're going to talk about, um, the agenda that's being set for the conference. So that was could have kind of maybe caused some problems today. Um, and there's some tensions between the more developed countries and the less de developed countries on what how things are going to be set. So what limits on pollution or greenhouse gases or anything are going to be done um, and then who's going to be paying for these adaptation and mitigation strategies that are necessary to get to the limits that were uh, put into place during the Paris Agreement. Um, so here's kind of a view of what's happening in front of me. That's the exhibitor area and there's a whole other area that's pavilions um, where all the countries are represented and then there's a whole separate center which is where the negotiations are happening and I'll be there tomorrow. Um, I don't anything else that's happening. Uh, so far, it's been really great. There's, as I said, tons of people from all over the world. The conference center here is two stories tall. Great food. They're trying to be as sustainable as possible and actually gave everybody really cool. I can't get it. It's fine. Free, <laughs> free water bottles, which Emmanuel is getting. Give me a second. Free water bottles that are plastic. Um, so, yeah, they've been doing a great job with that, and a lot of the food is vegetarian. And they actually give us all. So here's my badge, and they gave us this is too. It's mine. <laughs> and they gave us all um, free public transportation for the week to help eliminate any cars or anything and free bicycle rentals. So overall, first day has been great, pretty exhausting, but I'm learning a lot, and I will have another video tomorrow.